Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Lolly P. And if you're new here, I most definitely welcome you as well. And what are you waiting for? If you're not subscribed yet, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, hunty. And yeah, so in today's video, it's basically like, I guess you could say I get ready with me. This is gonna really annoy me. I'm sorry. I'm not used to this kind of all this hair comment below if you guys like this hair it's so different it's like going into that wig life but yeah anyways back to what i was saying but yeah in this today's video it's just a transformation video and how i go from basically waking up looking basic to this so if you guys want to see how i created this bomb look keep on watching Okay guys, so I'm going in with my MAC Prep and Prime Natural Radiance. I always use this to moisturize, 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 just to prep my skin for what's about to go on top. And now we're going to start with the eyes, and I'm going to go in with my NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil, with, and I'm going to place that all over my lid, just to have it have my eyeshadow to pop more when I place that color on my lids. I'm now going with my Juvia's Place, the Saharan palette, and I'm going in with Jamila and Sokoto, and I'm using that as my transition color in my crease. Next, I'll be going in with my other Juvia's palette, the Nubian palette, and I'll be using... There's no name on this, which is kind of a no-no for me. But yeah, so it's the fifth color shade, and I'm placing that all over my lid. Alright, so now that we've had both eyes done, I'm going in with my NYX Vinyl Liquid Liner. Vinyl or Vinyl? Probably Vinyl. Yeah, so I'm using that to line my eyes. Okay, so this is always my favorite part, prepping my eyelashes for my fake lashes. So I'm using Max and Holt and Naughty Lash to prep my eyes. So I like to always put mascara on before I use my lashes. And I'm super excited for these lashes that I'm going to be showing you. Yes, as you can see. It's the Celeste Los Angeles Lash Book. Like literally 16 pairs of lashes. So cute. So I'm going in with the name Riri. I actually pointed to Bella in the book, but I felt Riri was more acceptable for this look. And yeah, that is what I'm going in with. These lashes are gorgeous and I highly recommend this book. Like I feel like I've never seen a lash book like this before and I just had to purchase this. Absolutely love them. They're so pretty.
Okay, well, if you guys are a current subscriber, you guys know that I always use my MAC Studio Fix Fluid Foundation in the color NW47 for my foundation. I feel like that's like the best foundation. I mean, there's probably other best foundations, but this is absolutely my favorite foundation. I mean, it just blends in with my skin so perfect. It took me a while to find an actual shade that matches, and Max did it for me. And now to highlight, I'm going in with my LA Girl Pro Concealer in the color Fawn. And I'm placing that under my eyes and on the bridge of my nose, Cupid's bow, and my chin and also my forehead. And I'm going to be going in with a beauty blender, use my Fix Plus to spray that beauty blender, make sure that it is wet. And I'm going to use that to dab it in every area that I place my concealer in. And now to set my concealer, I'm going to go in with the Sasha setting powder in the color Buttercup and I'm going to place that basically everywhere where I put my concealer in just to set that in. I am now going in with my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish Powder in the color Dark and I'm using this to set my all over my face just to make sure everything's blended in and my face does match my neck because I do have a slight bit of discoloration in my chest and neck area so yeah that's what that's meant for and now I am using my favorite blush it's MAC called um, Lovejoy and I'm using that to First, I'm starting off on my cheekbones and I'm bringing it up. And yeah. And to give me that glow that I love, 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 I'm using Max Hyper Real Glow and I'm using the third one. I don't think it has a name for it. And I'm also using, using Max Perfectly Lit Mineralized Skin Finish as well. And I'm using that to highlight my cheekbones. And I'm going to use that on the bridge of my nose because I love that golden type of look that's always on my nose. I don't know why, but I feel like it's just popping. Like, look at that. And yeah, I always place that on the, my cupid's bow and on my chin and above both of my eyebrows just to give it a little sass.
And now time for the lips. I'm going with Max Giambattista Bali. I guess that was like a collaboration that they did together. But yeah, I'm going in with this. It's a matte shade. And I'm not using liner, um, lip pencil on my lips today. I felt this was sufficient enough. Okay guys, so here's a little trick that I usually like to do and a lot of people always ask me, oh, how do I get that kind of look? It's kind of like white in the middle, but it still looks nice. But yeah, I use my jumbo eye pencil, the same pencil milk that I go in with on my eyes and I use that, just placed it in the middle of my lips and there we have it. Oh, and yes, I obviously finish off this look with my MAC Prep and Prime Fix Plus in the color Rose. Smells amazing. And now I'm just like, I'm just that wig. Ooh, this wig is everything. This color, I actually really love this color. Oh my gosh. That brings us to the end of the video. I hope you guys love this look. Like, I love it. It's so pretty. Oh my gosh. And yes, don't forget to like, share, comment below, and of course, subscribe. And I will definitely be seeing you guys all in my next video. Mwah.